the Bugaboo B6 compared to the Nuna Triv. If you've watched the channel before, you know that Bugaboo and Nuna are two of my favorite brands. I just love them. I love their strollers. I love their products. And I'm excited about showing these two strollers to you because they are a really good head-to-head -head comparison. They both come with car seat adapters included. They're both light enough to go in your trunk or ro and robust enough to walk around in the city. But there are more differences. And in this video, I'm going to be pointing them out to you and breaking them down for you step by step. Now, if you still have more questions after you watch this video, and you might, you should email me your questions to questions that means.com, leave a comment below, give me a call, or the best thing to do is book a free virtual consultation with one of our experts, where we will take you through our store via Zoom and show you these two strollers or any other stroller that we sell at Magic Beans. And just remember that the Nuna Triv and the Bugaboo B6 are available to buy from us from Magic Beans with free shipping if you live outside of Massachusetts, you save tax as well. So here is the Nuna Triv compared to the Bugaboo B6. I have the Bugaboo B6 and the Nuna Triv. It's the end of 2020. These are the 2020, 2021 strollers. They're both compact strollers that you may be considering. The nice thing about these two strollers is that they are have nice wheels if you live in the city and do lots of long walking, lots of long, long walking, long walks. And if you live in the suburbs or if you're using the car a lot, these are both light enough. They're all they're both about 20 pounds that you could just put it right in the trunk of your car. Um, for the Bugaboo B6, they actually made the wheels larger. They're seven inch wheels now. So I think in terms of comparing them to these other compact strollers like the Triv or the Cruise, you should definitely be considering the B6 as well. Um, really beautiful quality on both of them. We love Nuna, we love Bugaboo. Um, really great suspension on the B. They've always had a really good spring suspension, but I think they've just really, they've upgraded the hardware for 2020 for the B6, 2021 B6, and you can really feel that quality. By the way, I do full reviews of the Triv and the B6 on the channel. So if you want to see a really in-depth review, you should um, click and watch those videos after this video. But in this video, it will just be a comparison. Let me show you how they fold. Let's start with that. So in terms of the B, what you want to do is you just want to like line up the seat with the handlebar. Um, there is adjustable handlebars on the B, as you can see. And you just push in these little buttons on the side. You pull and it goes right down. You can put it to the ground, but the nice thing is that there is a, um, a little stand now for the B6 that it comes included so that you can have it stand on its own. Um, in terms of folding down the Triv, it's one of the best folds out there these days. Just fold that over, and then there's just a simple handlebar clip. Folds up like that, really, really easy. When the seat is facing you, it stands on its own perfectly. Um, not so much in the forward facing position, but again, that's such a super easy fold. Open it back up like that. Um, to turn the seat around, what you do is, you just pull it back open. Um, full recline for newborn on both. To turn the seat around on the Triv, you push the buttons on the side on the left, and it turns. Um, there is a really nice inlay, and, a, and which you can remove, and there's air mesh on the back for extra bre breathability. For the B, to open the back up, you just put your foot down there on the axle, and you just pull it towards you. To turn the seat around on the B, you just pull this little lever on the back, pull it forward, and you turn the seat around, line it up and now the baby can face you. So you can see baby can face you. The B is definitely lower than the Triv, but still not, not super low, still not super low. Um, the Bugaboo B6 now has a belly bar, which it didn't have in previous varieties, which I think is really cool. Like I said, it folds, both strollers fold with a seat facing you as well. Um, there is a, how about this? There is a um, two peekaboo windows on the B6 and on the Triv, there is a, like a sun visor, and then you open this up, and there is ventilation on the side, and the peak of a window is on the back as well. So they have the, so the two peak of a windows, but here there are sort of three air venting situations on the Triv. Um, something that's new for the, uh, they both work with Nuna Pippas. Um, in fact, the Bugaboo B is, um, really optimized for Bugaboo's newest infant car seat, which is the Bugaboo Turtle 1 by Nuna, 
which is actually kind of like a version of the new Nipipa. So let me show you how the car seat adapters work on both, because the car seat adapter on the trip is actually really cool. So we can just remove the seat of the trailer. Let me see this. And you can just sort of remove it. Let's all fold it up nicely like that. There's the car seat adapter for the Triv. Click it on like that. And then for the B, you can add the adapters with the seat attached, but let me show you with the seat off. You just pull it over. So like I said, the adapter comes included with the Triv, the adapter comes included with the um, with the B. Um, if you look at Maxi Cozy adapters and you want to know, Maxi Cozy is the typical type of adapter that many um, strollers come with. If you do your research, you'll see Maxi Cozy adapters. It's because Maxi Cozy is a really popular European infant car seat brand. You want the posts to sort of face you versus, versus facing out. So the face towards me, I can see that, and it clicks right on, clicks right on. Here's the new Pippa. Clicks right on, so you can just like, you say, throw it right on. I, don't, I wouldn't recommend you throw your baby, but you just can place it gently. That's better. Place your baby gently on the car seat adapter, and then you just remove it. And then you can actually also line up. So a ring adapter, well, it actually goes in really easily as well. So it is easier to have a ring adapter than the post adapters, but as you can see, that just went right on to the Bugaboo B. Now the cool thing about the folding mechanism of this ring adapter, let me show you, it's really, really, really cool. Just look here, see how that folds down like that? It's really, and it's just, it's really light. And you put it right into your trunk of your stroller and you open this back up. And then in terms of, you just push these two buttons on the side and as well, you can fold down your B. And again, also super light, so super light. So both of these strollers are gonna be great for the car and also for walking if you live in the city. And like I said, I do full reviews of the Triv and the B on the channel with lots of comparisons of them as well if you wanna see additional comparisons. So number one, I suggest that you subscribe today to, to be informed about the latest and greatest in baby gear. And I recommend that you watch another video from Atrabeans videos after this video. I will see you at the next video.